This demo shows how to enter a sales order in Microsoft Dynamics GP. Three easy steps. Create an order and assign a customer. Add an item and review suggested items related to the selected item. Review and save the order. Let's look at the demo. Here we select Sales Transaction Entry. The order entry form is comprised of three parts. Who and where you want to ship the order, what items or service you're going to ship, finally the total discount and tax of the order. The first section of the order entry system is the header. Here you select who and where you want to ship an order. Tab across the header fields to complete the sections. Notice how information such as shipping address and warehouse automatically default for the customer. Next, we add a line item to the order. Click the lookup button to find an item. Notice that we can prefix the lookup list with a leading letter, X in this case. This speeds the entry of items when the item numbers are known. Let's select the highlighted item, Xbox 250 HD. Microsoft Dynamics GP allows organizations to suggest additional sales items based on part numbers. This enables organizations to provide users with a list of related items to sell. Companies with this feature enabled can improve customer service and increase revenue opportunities. Here we see a suggested item for an Xbox Gold membership. Select the Xbox Live 12 suggested item to pair with this order. This enables your salespeople to offer upsell and cross-sell items as the order is being placed. With the item selected, we hit OK to add the item to the order. The red highlighted section provides order summary information like subtotal tax and shipping details. These are default calculations and are based on item or customer details. You can adjust or add other charges before completing the order. Entering a sales order in Microsoft Dynamics GP is simple. This is demonstrated with minimal keystrokes, autofill defaults, and suggested items while entering an order.